Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and today we're playing Ember Ward. So yeah, this is just the demo, so we're gonna get this a try, but uh yeah, this looks like a pretty interesting game. Um Okay. Let's go normal mode. This is like a tower defense. It's like a it's that like Tetris graphics. Um Like yeah, if you look at it, it's kinda like Tetris pieces. At the bottom here, and then it, um, but then yeah, then you have different towers as well that you can put, and yeah, you build your own little maze, and then you're just you're defeating the enemies using the towers that you get. Um, that seems pretty cool. Drone tower, dart tower, cannon tower. Choose a set you like. I'm gonna go. I. Mainly because of the drone tower here. Ooh, and we get a relic to start off with. Okay, this is cool. If the damage taken in the level is three points or less, recover one health point upon completing the level. Start each level. Kill monster are affected by the chill effect. First time your fire source takes damage, freeze all monsters. Summon additional lightning to strike the target. Ooh. That'd be good for a lightning tower, yeah. Go with that. So all that did was give us... Okay, so we just get a starting... Uh, starter set there. Oh, I... Do not know what these things... Mean. So battle, barracks, battle, battle, battle. Uh, battle corrupted. So we probably want to... Let's go... I'm thinking here, then here. Then we can go here, here. Alright, trying to kind of figure out my path. What's an altar? Ooh. There's a shop. Yeah, let's go to the shop, then the boss. Because I don't know if we really... Do we want to take it on a corrupted battle? Yeah, I don't, I don't think we do. A corrupted battle right before a, a boss doesn't sound like a good idea. Okay, so we kind of we already have our path mapped out. Okay, so build the maze. The enemies are coming. Drag the wall card onto the field to control the path of the monsters. Wall cards placed during the building phase can be long pressed to be recalled, but once you enter a battle, they would be locked and cannot be recalled. Okay, so we just have to put these down um, wherever we want them to go. Uh, I mean, preferably we'd want it to like go along. These are like these are really bad pieces. Um, yeah, we want it to be like something like this. Looks terrible. Uh, on it. Okay, can we rotate them? Okay, we can. Okay. Okay, that's, that's really good to know. We can rotate, okay. Then let's do, okay. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I spend a lot of time trying to put this thing together. I'm a Okay, can we do like this and then, and then like that? How's that look? I feel like that's probably just about as good as we're gonna get with with what we got here. I don't know if we're gonna do much better. Yeah. Kind of looks just about as good. Okay. We could spend gold to, like, draw. Do we want to do that? Sure. Ooh, okay. So we could... Okay. Oh, okay. You can put it outside of the map. Okay. It's very interesting. That, this piece is very weird shaped I'll be honest <laughs> we, we want it to be like 
they have to like go around. Like go, yeah. What I'm thinking is like I want them to go like in. I don't think I'm able to do that. Whatever. Let's just get into actually putting down the towers now that I'm like just kind of messing around with everything. Honestly, I don't even really like where the pieces are set. Um, so let's just do that, and everyone's gonna be mad at me. Just be, a, just people are just gonna be like, just put the pieces on the map. Doesn't matter where you put them. Just put them down. know what I say to that? I don't know. I have nothing to say. Can I move you? Sir? Can I... Okay. I guess you just have to sell it. Yeah, you just, you just have to sell it. Um, I'm probably gonna actually put the lightning tower, like, in here. I think this area, is, this area here is gonna be a pretty good spot, um, for things. And we could just put this scrap tower, like, right there or something. Okay, I think we're ready. I did not realize that there was multiple pathways. That, well, that was the first wave. Okay, we did good. Okay. Um, let's go with, like, right there. Do you want to do that? Yeah, sure. Oh, countdown. Okay. Can't just dilly-dally. Gotta actually put pieces down. Yeah, I really do not like exact. I don't really like where my pieces are. Do something like this. But let me just do like. So I could do that and have it like go this way. And then get a piece to put here, to block it, like put a piece here, block it, so then it has to go up that way. Okay. I like that. I like that. And I think we'll put that guy there. Okay. The battle. I think let's draw while we're at it. Mm. Yeah, these pieces are not my favorite. Let's do that, let's do that. Okay. Got some more gold. So, let's just put that guy there. I like that piece, I like that piece. I like this piece as well, this piece is pretty nice. Um, yeah, def definitely want to put that outside of the arena. 
definitely makes a lot of sense to do that. Why not? Okay. What about that? I mean... Yeah, I guess that works. I mean, we don't... Do I have a better spot for this? Not really. Okay. Uh, oh wait, we have more gold. Okay. Then I might as well spend it. Okay. Then yeah, I think this is probably fine. I think this is an okay setup. It's not my favorite looking tower defense thing, you know? Like, tower setup, I should say. Um, but I think, I think it'll, I think it'll do okay. As long as we can optimize the attack area, and put a lot of lightning towers around, and put, you know, strong towers in this area where most of the enemies are gonna are gonna be at you know, for long periods of time. Uh, ah, so this guy barely just sells for zero. Okay. Uh, if I do that, then it's straight on. But if I go like that, then it has to. I'll do that. I mean, this few stuff. I mean, I guess I could put it like on the outer part. Like, I, it doesn't have to be just like inside. I could like ex extend the area in which they have to travel. And I could. Oh my gosh! You can put towers out. You can put towers outside of the <laughs> this maze part. That's awesome. Okay, yeah, sure, let's go for it. We can basically start, like, spawn camping these guys. This is pretty cool. I'll have to see if I can get the full release for this game, because this actually seems pretty sick. I like I like the idea of just building your own maze. I always love like tower defense games and you know combining that with like like a maze builder type thing, that seems pretty sick as well. And then we could have them go. Yeah, have them go like this way. Um, which one would be better? Doesn't really work. trying to make this thing this piece work and I want it to be like it blocks off this part but then they have to like go around like that but I want it to not block off that I want it to be like that I still want them to have to go up that way okay that works kind of for the most part, this works. Oh, wow. We have a lot of gold. I didn't realize how much gold we had. Let's just put a bunch of lightning towers down. Why do you... So, I guess the... 
I guess the longer that they're around, the less they sell for. So like the more waves that you that you put them down for, like the less they're worth. They're like they're like more used, I guess. Something like that. Okay, that's interesting. Oh, okay. Was not expecting him to do that. Yeah, that guy's definitely definitely a goner. Okay, nice. Made it through that stage. Okay, we unlocked a new card. Boulder Tower. Um. Uh, mm, briefly, briefly stunning is pretty cool. This is the two by two. I don't know how I feel about that though. I'm assuming the two by two is the size of the tower. So yeah, I think we're gonna go for barracks. Let's see what's here. Do not sell any towers. Keep enemies at least three towers away from the fire source. Keep enemies at least five. Can we get we go? Hmm. Okay. okay. We'll go with that. We get. I mean, we were keeping them really far from the fire, so I'm fairly confident that we. Oh. That is different. Okay, so are they only coming from that way? Because if they are, then I could make use of this and have them go around this way. Okay, so it does get... Okay, okay, okay. Because I, I, I think I wanted to go, like, on the outer part and really keep them away, like, keep them the five tiles away. I'm fairly confident I could probably do that. Nice. Okay. Nice. Ooh, we got this guy now. Okay. Okay, we could do that. And have them, you know, like I said, go along the like outer part. Then I could have it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll do it. I'll do it like this. I like this. I like this. I should draw one more. Just to be sure. Let's go like that. Okay, this guy should be able to take him out, right? Yeah. Yeah, those guys are basically one shot. Okay. Then we can get that. Then we can get something like that. Um, 
Let's just do that. Or n no, 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 no. Okay, okay, okay. Because we wanted to get like close, right? We wanted to get in close with with this block here. So then we maximize like the damage output of that thing. We put that guy next to him as well. And we'll put like that guy there too. Let's draw another piece. And then yeah, we'll have that go on the outer part. Okay. I'm liking how things are looking so far. We're keeping them far away from from the campfire. And we're putting our like strongest towers on on the bonus damage. So I think we should be pretty good. Oh, that guy's going to be a little, little rough, I think, to deal with. Hopefully not too bad. Does have me a little concerned, though. We're definitely going to need to make it so that they go on the inner part. Oh, crap. No. No. Gosh dang it. Can we restart? I didn't realize he was going to explode into a bunch of... Gosh dang it. This is, I think this is a pretty good setup, though. Even though we did have that unfortunate turn of events where that guy ended up making it through and spawning a bunch of little guys. That was really unfortunate. Hold on, let's throw things down. I actually wonder if the ice guys are pretty are gonna be good. They do, like, scale and damage. That seems pretty good. Make it do something like that. And let go more like that. Have more go in. And maybe try to kind of extend out this part here. Okay. 
Yeah, this this is a this this is a tricky one. Well, I'm not too sure what we could have really done better, but there's probably something which really sucks, but it is what it is. Things are going things are going well now. But I wish they would have gone a little bit better before. Before all that stuff happened. Dang. See, so yeah, I'm thinking like extend out okay. They're always going to be taking the, the shortest path. So I just need to make sure that this is never the shortest path. That I'm just going all the way around like this. This is becoming increasingly difficult <laughs> If, honestly, hold on. I could set this up now. Where I keep it so that they stay in this area. And, okay, well, they're going to end up going around, but... There we go. Okay. So yeah, the idea is to, if I can connect this whole area up, right, then I could start sectioning off more of the, of the area to keep it... Okay, they're going... Okay. They're going farther than I would like them to go. I'm just gonna spam that down. Okay. Okay. I think I think what we need to do here is like I said. Um like connect up this area then they literally have no choice but to to go that way. And then I could do kind of like the same here. Um, 
Okay. If I... That... That's the opposite of what I wanted it to do. We'll do that. And we'll see how it goes. Because I want it to... I want them to go, like, around this way... And then end up going through here, and then going through here, and things like that. Basically, I just, I'm just trying to, like, make the path be very, very long for them. And it's kind of working, kind of not. Things are... Things are just getting hectic. And I'm just I'm just trying to spam towers down to minimize the uh, the uh, the negative effects of the problems that I am causing. Oh, we cleared the stage. Oh, okay. I didn't have too much to worry about, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, challenge failed. Yeah, that... Yeah. That did happen. Oh. Determines the... That sounds horrible. Um. Ooh, that would be good. Frost Tower. Use the experience points gained from adventures to learn very. Ooh, talent. Okay. Here's the preparation time. Oh, okay. That's cool. I didn't realize there was a whole, uh, whole roguelite aspect to this. Okay, we didn't really do very well with the normal battle. Oh, and our health doesn't go back up. Oh. And there's corrupted tiles. There's there's a lot of bad things around that I'm noticing. Uh, so they have increased attack range, which would be good for the frost tower. Um, so I'm thinking. Which I don't normally do. I don't normally think. But. When I do. Then you know things are getting serious. So what I'm thinking. Um. Okay. <sighs> this does not really work. Okay, this would work better. Let's see. Okay, because I'm thinking, right? As I've said like 50 times now. Put that there. Okay, now we, t now we can have one thing take advantage of both of those. Okay. And then... Maybe we don't do that yet. We could do like that, maybe? Do we want it? No, we don't want that. We want it because we want to. Because we want things going around like that. This way. And then to really take advantage of that stuff down there. Um.
Well, so yeah, let's go with that. And then I'm gonna try to save up for a frost tower. Which was a bad idea. Wow. Okay. This actually seems like a pretty good piece. I just don't know where to really put it. Can they go around back there? Yeah, they can. So then we could have it like that, I guess. Lock up this part. Okay. Wait, what? They should be able to... Are they not... Oh my gosh, the whole... The game's lying to me. Okay, well... Jeez, we did really badly, but I was 